The deep scars forever a reminder of the Valentine's Day that turned to darkness. As Anthony Borges showed his scars to the jury this week, a painful reminder of what he had to endure. I just reached out my phone and I called my mom first. She didn't answer, I called my best friend. She didn't answer and then I called my dad. So I told her everything, like goodbye and everything. Borges was one of the most gravely wounded from the mass shooting. He was shot five times, bullets ripping through his lung, abdomen, and legs. He was found by Deputy Richard Van Durham's as he screamed in the hallway of the freshman building. I went up to the, um, the third floor uh, where uh, three other officers were at. Um, and at that time, we, uh, we looked down the hallway, and there was a... Um, child all the way at the uh, very end. Deputy Vanderham says six officers came to his aid. He was kind of like trying to raise his hand up um, and he was trying to say something but he kept trying to raise his hand up so we, we could see that he was alive. His classmates call him a hero, some probably alive today because of Anthony's bravery. Despite his wounds, he barricaded the classroom doors shut as the gunman continued his deadly rampage.